Hey, it's Mike here. In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to find your downloads in case you lost them and you can't find them on your Mac. One of the quickest ways to get directly to your download folder is to go to open up your finder. And at the top here, just click on go and downloads. Notice that by the downloads, there is also a key uh, combination press that I will put right here. But like many of you, if you're not used to using any of these uh, type of keys, then you know, it's just not going to be as easy to find. So enter in this next method. All right, usually on your Macintosh, when you go down to Finder, which is this little guy right over here, you can find the downloads down here, okay? It's usually here, but it's not always there. Sometimes it goes missing. I don't know why. I don't know what you guys do. So the real simple way if you need immediately to find your downloads is you find a command key on your keyboard, hold that down and press the space bar. That opens up something called the spotlight search. Just type in downloads, okay? And then it'll be right there, folder, okay? So that's one way to find it. So you see you have all these downloads here? That's one way to put it. Now, if you wanna put it back here in your favorites, the simplest way to do that is to go and when you open up Finder, go up to the top, click on the Finder, click on settings. From the settings, you'll have these things. Show these items in the sidebar. For whatever reason, some of you guys don't have it on there. Someone removed it. Put down your favorites in there. So one of those things is downloads. That should be one of your favorite things to do. You put the desktop as well in case you want to easily find it as well on the left-hand side. So what, ha what happens is it puts it right here. You see this? It's now here. Now, if you want to move it around, you can just hold down on the item here and just drag it up and down the way you like it and wherever you want to put it. Now, I suggest you also put the location of any hard drives or any external storage on here so it shows up here real easy for you to access, as you can see. And, uh, you know, that makes life really easy that way. So now if you ever need to find your downloads again, it's just a matter of going to your finder, opening it up and finding it right where you left it. So put it wherever it makes the most sense for you. Putting it by documents makes sense. These are where all your downloads are. So if you open up your browser and you're downloading something, let's say I'm downloading the new VLC media player. I click download VLC. It'll start downloading. And of course, normally when it does, when it does down, download, it puts it down here in this section. This is where a lot of times you'll find it as well. So these are all the previous downloads, then you can find it in the finder. But now that you have it here, you can always reach it there in case you downloaded it a while ago. You see you have stuff downloaded from earlier in the month and it's all right over here. Now, if you're on Chrome, same situation, except Chrome, actually you can choose downloads and it'll show you the list of the downloads that you had on here. Okay, and then you can actually do click on it and find it as well from there. But by default, it will also save it into where we had just found it right here in the downloads. All right, that's it for this video. Please give it a like, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you next one. Let me know if you have any weird things that you need solved uh, because I feel like uh, some of these things are frequently asked questions and these videos can be helpful to some of you. Thanks for watching.